Dailymotion.com is one of the video sharing websites that we upload videos to. You are going to need your account spreadsheet and your URL spreadsheet, and you should have set up your Dailymotion account by this time. The first thing we're going to do here is copy the Gmail address that we used to open the Dailymotion account, and then in a separate window or in a separate browser here, go ahead and open Dailymotion.com. In the upper right hand corner, click sign in, paste in your Gmail address, and then type in your password. Click login, and then in the center of the page at the top here you can click upload a video, click upload a video, select the video that you want to upload. And then while the video is actually uploading, we're going to go ahead and enter in some of the information down below here. The video title we can copy from the URL spreadsheet if you have already written it. If you have not written a title and description yet, that's okay. You can just go ahead and do that as we go along here. The description here is also from the URL spreadsheet. And then up above here we need to select a channel. Sometimes these are kind of hard to fit, so just go ahead and pick the one that is a best fit. This box should be empty. This video should be viewable for all audiences. The tags should be any keywords that you're trying to focus on. As you'll see here, Daily Motion provides suggested tags here, so if you see something that fits, go ahead and select it. Otherwise you can just hit enter and you can keep the tag as you typed it in. And then we've already put in the description so we're going to go down here. Some of these options down below don't need to be changed. For example, privacy settings I typically just leave as is. Add to, you can change what users are allowed to do. Um, more details here, the language should be English unless you have a video in a different language. The video recorded on, you can just leave that as today. And then here is really important, you can type in your address and this will help generate another citation for your business on the internet. So this I would recommend doing. I'm going to skip this step because I have a fake address that the site won't recognize anyway, so I'm just going to skip that. Down here, the next video feature is really cool. Um, if you already have several or even just one other video on Dailymotion, you can go ahead and grab that Dailymotion URL and paste it into this field. That means that when this video that you just finished uploading is done playing, it will automatically transition and start showing another video from you. Um, this is just kind of a neat feature so you can keep viewers on your videos instead of having them kicked off to another music video or some other related video that might show up. So just kind of an extra bonus feature here. Um, if you don't have another video at this time, that's perfectly fine. If you do and you remember, you might want to come back later and add this URL in here. The pay-per-view is another option here that we don't do, so I'm just going to skip that and then click Save. And now the video has been successfully updated. You can click see your video, and the video might start playing right away, so you can go ahead and pause that. Sometimes it's not quite ready yet, so I'm just going to go up here and copy the URL, and then go back to your URL spreadsheet here, and in the URL column, go ahead and paste this URL, and then the file name is the name of the file that's on your computer, which is addictiontreatment.mp4. And then going back to Daily Motion, I just want to show you real quick here. If you ever need to edit a video or delete a video, you can come down here to the admin console and you can edit the information or delete the video. So that's just a little piece of information there. Once you have all of your videos uploaded, you can click the down arrow in the upper right hand corner and click log out.